No. So previously, I would have said yes. Previously, okay. I would have said, oh, shit, 5 to 8 is, is bad. Okay. Um, mm-hmm. Because previously, I would put a lot more value into what the public thinks or what the public considers success. But that is no longer the case. At this point, the only thing that I care about is what I deem success. As long as I consider uh, the season is, is a success, I don't really care about what, what other people think anymore. One of the reasons that we didn't do as well is if you look at the entire ecosystem. Because Overwatch League hadn't started yet, a lot of the teams had uh, two-way players within their teams, right? So the competition was a lot steeper. We had fusions. Uh, Gator was in Atlanta. Uh, Elk was on on, on, the, on Fusion. Like all, all of this. So the rosters were very, very strong at that point yeah. because when Overwatch League isn't running, teams aren't really picking up like players, right? There's the expansion teams are picking up new roster, but there weren't that many like pickups besides that. It meant that like a lot of good talent just kind of like started turning into a traffic jam and there was a lot of good talent in, in contenders. Yeah. And more importantly, if you look at all of these teams, if you look at Atlanta, if you look at, at Second Wind, who have yeah. been together for so long, if you look at Fusion University, who have been together for three seasons, if you look at Team Envy, who have been together with multiple seasons, if you look for, for with XL2, who have been together for multiple seasons, being together for multiple seasons is very, very important because it builds a synergy. And GOATS is not a team comp about individually popping off. It's a team comp about synergy and about teamwork yeah. and about succeeding as a team. We were a roster that was built, was put together for that season. These players haven't really played together. We got Fusions as a replacement for Decod pretty much as the season started. We got Klaus as the season started. We got Punk as soon as the season started. Asking hasn't played in a contender season. The entire roster was completely new. So at that point, I knew that there is no way that we could build a level of synergy that would be able to compete with any of the other teams. And I accepted that, and that was completely fine with me. What I focused on is giving, just, just focusing on le- long-term progress that these players could use going into the next season, right? It's a marathon, it's not a race. So even getting fifth through eighth, if I would have gotten anything better that season, I would have been very, very surprised. And it wouldn't have been because of my success. It would have been because of the other team's failures. Hey guys, hopefully you enjoyed this clip. Make sure to click the link up above and subscribe and turn on notifications. I put out weekly videos every Wednesday, 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time.